ladies and gentlemen, you, you all know why you're here tonight, but the re realistically, for every life taken, which is just shy of 450 guys and women from, from Afghanistan and Iraq, or from Afghanistan itself, about 4,000 are injured. It's what, you, it's what we don't hear about. We hear about the guys coming back who've lost their lives, but the injuries we, you, never, you never hear about. Arms, legs will, will never grow back, as well as mental injuries. Um, images of your best friend being blown up next to you, that's something that will never leave you. And that's something that a lot of the guys have to endure every single day. And it's also something that a lot of guys don't even know will affect them in five, 10 years time. And we, have a, we are duty bound, I believe, to, to assist and to help where we can. Afghanistan will become old news. It's barely on the news now. So imagine what it's going to be like in two, three, four, five years time. Um, Afghanistan will be forgotten to a certain extent. And maybe these guys will be forgotten. But with walking with the wounded, help for heroes, etc., and with all your help here tonight, we need to make sure that that doesn't happen.